Let's talk about spray caps. Hi, my name is Chuck and today I'm gonna tell you which caps I use and when I use them. Recently I started putting all the information about the caps that I use and cans and colors in the description. But still under almost every video people are asking me which caps that I've been using. But I never really explained why I choose certain caps in the process during sketching, the fill-in or outlining. So that's what I'll be doing in this video. But I was really surprised that someone found my spot and gave me a nice shout out. Put a trope on that wall using these 10 caps and I'm gonna do a pink fill in with a black outline. The first cap. This one is the black cap with orange dot. This one comes standard with Montana black cans and it's like a soft fat cap. Most of the time I use these or any other fat caps to get out the paint or get out the first paint of the can because it can be really thick. And now I'm sure these cans are ready to use. I'm gonna put on a smaller or thinner cap and I can choose between a couple of them. So I got two kinds of caps over here. The first one are the outline caps and like skinny caps. To be honest, I'm not sure if this is like a skinny cap or more like an outline cap, but it's called a pocket cap. And when I sketch, I normally go for this one or the Montana level one cap, this one. So when I start painting, I always start with the sketch. I use either the pocket cap or the level one from Montana. Let's use them both for the sketch. First, the Montana level one. So as you can tell, the line is really thin. And let's finish the sketch with the pocket cap. Well, you we can't always go perfect, right? So over here you can see the difference between the level one cap and the pocket cap. As you can see the edge of the line, it's a bit dusty, but the output of this cap is higher than the level one cap. So if I want to be a bit quicker or do my lines faster, then I always choose this cap. So these three caps are all outline caps and are a nice but a little bit of a slow way to fill your pieces or throw ups. This one is the German outline cap. This one is the yellow universal cap. And this is the standard cap of the loop cans. But they're pretty much the same. Let's see how they perform. First, the German outline cap. Second, the yellow universal cap. You can already tell they're pretty much the same. And the third one, the loop standard cap. So yeah, three different caps, but they do almost exactly the same thing. The reason why I have three kinds is that these come with loop and sometimes I buy bags with a hundred caps in them and some shops have the German outline caps and other shops have the yellow universal caps. So those outline caps are nice but oh, they're way too slow for my taste. 
So back to the standard Montana black cap. Black cap, orange dot, soft fat cap. Already a lot quicker as you can tell. I can be really impatient so most of the time I use this cap for my fill-ins. But if I want to speed up things a little bit more than this, I can go with the pink fat cap. White cap, pink dot. But if I want to be really quick, I can go with the yellow super fat cap or the Montana level 6 cap. So this cap is a real beast. There you go. And now let's go for the yellow super fat cap. And you're done. So this used to be a pocket cap. You can barely tell, but I simply love doing outlines on throw-ups with this one. Like I said before, you can paint really quick with it and it gives a nice thin line. Bang. And the same for the needle cap. This one is a really high output cap and also gives a really thin line. But if you don't move fast enough, you will get drips with this one. For really fast, thin lines. Oh, and you can use them as a fire extinguisher. Not a pretty tech, but now you know what you can do with a needle cap. Also, back to the level Montana level one cap. I use this cap for sketching, but when I have enough time and I'm doing a nice piece, I use this one. You can also do a lot of details with this cap. This cap already had its best time. And then back to the Montana standard cap. I think it's a really nice cap for nice outlines. It has the right thickness for my taste. So that was the Montana black standard cap, but I'm going one step back with the German outline cap. Really, the super fat cap and the Montana level six cap, I only use them for fill-ins because they are way too thick and uncontrollable for outlines. Still have to do the little drip, so I'll show you. Well, it went pretty well, but it's just too thick, don't like it. It's definitely not the most beautiful throw up, but at least now you know which cap I use and when I use them. <laughs>